Well, get this. A mother goes into labor prematurely during that long flight to Hawaii. But as luck would have it, there was a doctor and three nurses on board, and they all sprang into action. News Nation's Chris Searcy has the amazing story. Lavinia Maunga was traveling to Hawaii with family, completely unaware that she was pregnant. She began to feel some discomfort, so she made her way to the bathroom. Minutes later, screams for help were heard echoing through the plane. Hey, get over here, like, get, get over, over here, here now, now, like, now. come over what? here. Get over here. Three North Kansas City nurses, Lady Banfield, Amanda Beating, and Mimi Ho, who were on a girl's trip, sprang into action. And I went back there first, and she is holding a baby down at the bottom, like, underneath the toilet almost. And so I'm yelling, Mimi, there's a baby, and it's little. <laughs> Baby Raymond Maunga was only 27 weeks old. Astoundingly, all three nurses work in the neonatal intensive care unit at North Kansas City Hospital. Immediately, they knew um, what to do. Asking for all these supplies, just, you know, oxygen, anything we keep the baby warm with. They made a makeshift oxygen mask, used a shoestring to tie the cord, put the baby skin to skin with Lavinia to keep him warm and used an Apple watch to monitor the baby's heartbeat until the plane landed. When the nurses visited Lavinia and baby Raymond at Capiolani Medical Center, there wasn't a dry eye in the room. It's been so good. Everybody's so nice and you know the Aloha spirit is definitely felt here. Lavinia says these nurses are Ohana, a Hawaiian phrase that means family. And as soon as she started tearing up, we did, and she called us family and like her the baby's aunties, and it was just really sweet to just be able to see her again. Chris Searcy, News Nation.